तो हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू दिस चैनल आई होप यू आर आर एब्सोल्युट फाइनेंस एंड एम एनी इफ यू आर रिक्वेस्टिंग लाइक After filling the interest form, what is the criteria to get selected in the Arcade Facilitator program, and what are the things we need to take in mind? And one more important thing, like how many students we have to enroll, what are the swags, what is the criteria? Do facilitators also have a milestone? So here in this video, we'll cover all these things. So before we start, make sure you subscribe the channel and hype the video so that it reaches the genuine audience and we can just build a better community. Now here, yesterday only I posted a video like how you can become a arcade facilitator. If you haven't watched that video, I link the video in the description. Basically, in that video, I have explained how you can become a facilitator, how you have to fill the form correctly, how you to share in uh, correct details over there, and then how you can just ensure that you are getting selected by just answering uh, correct questions over there. Now, once you have submitted the form, the next step is that the nomination. Now, in the arcade facilitator program, more than lakhs of submissions are done, but they filter the genuine answers. So make sure you don't blindly copy paste the chat GPT response over there. Just try to make it genuine, neat, and clean. I've explained all the things in the video. You can just check the video over there. Now, here we'll be talking about the next steps. Once you fill the form, what happens? So let me first of all prepare the notebook. So let me explain each and everything. So here, if you come over here, let me show you. I have prepared a perfect guidebook also. And here, in the Arcade Facilitator program, as I said earlier, here we have students and facilitator too. Who are students who will be just working as a participants? Like if you are completing, if you have achieved any milestone and got bonus point this time, or if you are new, do not worry. We have covered all the things in one video. I have linked that video. You can watch it. So here, for the people who have just achieved some bonus points, they are participants and facilitators are the mentor or guide who will be assisting you with credits, redemption of credits and your public profile, like setting up your public profile into public or how to complete the badges. They are facilitators, mentor or guide. Now here, this as this video is specifically for facilitators, so let's come over here to the guidebook. So here I have prepared a guidebook and this is for facilitator program cohort 1 2026. Yes, many of you might be thinking that this is not started. So yes, we are in the 2026 cohort and the facilitator program will be live soon. Very soon, the interest form is already live. Uh, as I have shared the video, as you can see over here that I have shared the video, I'll link the video. Do not worry about it. Okay, do not worry about it. I will link this video. Now let's come back to the PPT and let's see one by one. So here you can clearly see I have added the interest form guide also. Now after you fill the interest form guide, interest form, okay. Then the next step is that selection process. And after that is the nomination process and or onboarding process, milestone, facilitator, students and event start so this is the agenda of this video so after filling the interest form it they will just verify all your entries of all the participants after that during the selection process you will be getting an email if selected just before i think one month if the facilitator program starts from april you'll be getting mail on march whenever the mail will be live i'll make a detailed video again do not worry about it so you'll be getting a email which is like shortlisted you have been shortlisted and after that you have to fill the nomination form if you are not getting anything do not worry so after you fill this form you will be getting this form okay this email that congratulations your application has been shortlisted for next round of arcade facilitator cohort 2 so here you can clearly see that we have received an email from the program manager team that after filling the interest form we have been shortlisted now in the shortlisted form what you need to do you have to just nominate people okay once you have been shortlisted, you have to nominate now what does nomination means here if i explain like one facilitator in the facilitator program we have two facilitators and one is selected by the google itself with which whatever form you have filled and one you have to select by yourself he or she can be anyone like your friends your family members your husband your wife anyone even your kids also if they are in at least they must be 18 years of age okay 
they must have a minimum age of 18 plus to participate as a facilitator. Why? Because they ask for government ID. Yes, you heard it right. They ask for government ID during selection process. Here they will ask, what they will ask? They will ask your government ID like Aadhaar card. You, you don't share Aadhaar card, you can share driving license, voter ID, any government license, not your college ID also. You have to select share the government ID only which are valid as Indian government. So this you need to take care like even while filling the interest form your name should match the government ID also. So do not use any fake name to fill the form because it is a genuine event. Now after you get the shortlisted email you have to just do one thing. Let me share what you have to so here what you need to do let me explain so this i have already cleared now here in the shortlisted email what you need to do if i explain let me show you so first is your main facilitator okay main facilitator we have second one is co facilitator co means who will be assisting in your absence so Chances are there you may get into some exams, you may have some exams also or you may be traveling also. So in that case, if any participants faces some problems, then the co-facilitator will be assisting and co-facilitator can be anyone, your family members, like if you have brothers, sisters, younger who are at least 18 plus, you can use here. You can ask them to participate and you can just help them to build their careers. They will be getting some cool swags along with you. So here another query was that do the facilitator get the swag and do have we have to share with our co-facilitator too. So the answer is no. You both will be getting individual set of swags. Do not worry. And what are the swags I am sharing in the upcoming part of the video so stay tuned for it now here you understood the main process like here in this email only when where you will be getting the shortlisted that you have been shortlisted email you have to reply all the details like here you have to reply your name uh, name add name and your designation like you are working professional student your mobile number your public profile and all the details will be there in the email itself. You have to reply your details and hit space and just mention co-facilitator and there you have to share all of your co-facilitator details. After that, you'll be getting a Google form over there. You have to fill the form. You have to enter all your details like name, email, etc. If I show you, I think I have made a video also. So let me show you. I will attach all the videos over here. Shortlisted. I think I have made a shortlisted video. Wait a second. Nomination. Let me search once again. Let me first of all search it. Then I. So finally, I found a video over here. I was just searching. And here you can see this is the nomination form, how it looks like. Okay, you'll be getting your name over here and here you can clearly see that this is the nomination form and how does it looks like. Here you can see, as I said, what you have to share in the nomination form, you have to share your name, email ID, phone number, role and institution, whether you are a college student or working professional you have to mention over here and then hit enter then you have to just type co-facilitator and mention their details and here you have to reply to the email also here a nomination form is there and which you can clearly see over here if you want to see how you have to fill the nomination form how you have to fill all the details how you have to attach all the documents if I show over here, you can see all these documents are covered in this video. I'm not making this video longer. You can watch this video regarding the nomination progress also. I'll link the video in the description. You can check it out. So let's come over here. You understand the shortlisting process. Like in this process, we have to reply to the email with all the details of ours and facilitator. Along with it, I have, we have to share, uh, fill the form also, which will be shared in the email only. We have both have to fill like 
we and our co-facilitator have to fill the form. Now the next thing is that once you have filled the form, it may take up to a week or two to three days. In this cohort, it was happening very early, like after just three days only, the selection emails were out. So here, once you are selected, you will get this kind of email like congratulations, you are now a facilitator team. This is of 2025 only. We are sharing the latest details with you. So here, the same email will be sent to you and your co-facilitator. Okay, the same email will be sent to both of you. And as I said, both of you will be getting individual set of swags. You don't have to share and certificates do. So after that, once you get this team, there will be a link to join a Google Cloud chat community. Okay, you have to click on it and just join and introduce yourself. And after that, after a week or maybe two to three days, there will be info session where the main lead of the Google program, Arcade program team will be guiding you how you have to start all the things and how the session is generally one to two hour long. But do not worry, whatever will be happening in the sessions, I will share the key concepts important key concepts so that you can just start your journey. Now what happens? What are the things you need to do? After getting selected, you will be getting a chat link you have to join and you'll be getting a game, uh, sorry, game badge also that the arcade facilitator game badge. So you'll be getting the access code and the game link on your email if selected. Okay, if selected I am seeing, then you have to complete that badge. The badge is also very easy. You have to complete only one lab and if you face any issue, you already know the solution channel is here. You have to just subscribe the channel for more details. Now, once you have got the this thing, okay, that's you are in in the program. Now here the milestone thing, like how many badges you need to just drag, drive, and how many people need to be enrolled. This is the common query which many of you are asking. So let's come over here to our milestone section. So let me explain. So here you can clearly see if I zoom in that here we have your milestone that is facilitator milestone like if you are participating you are a facilitator as a facilitator sorry then you have to complete this milestone now here you can see driving 600 games 500 trivia games and 1400 skill patches no you may be worried how you'll drive this many games so for that only you have to enroll students how you'll find the students you are a college student okay you are a college student, you can just share with your seniors and if you are a senior, then you can just, it's very easy. If you are a senior, then you can just share the form with your juniors. They'll be joining with your referral code. Second thing, if you are just a college student, junior, then you can take help from your faculties also. You can share that I have been selected. We have this program free, of course. They will surely help you. And if you are working professional, you can just share on your social networks like LinkedIn, etc. And your networks will be just joining the program. So like this, you have to drive the people. Now here, if you want to know how many people we have to just join so you need to enroll at least 100 participants now many of you are thinking if you are if you have enrolled 100 participants then will we get the swag directly no here you can clearly see that driving 600 games so even if you join 100 participants under you then if you, they are not completing any arcade games skill badges or trivia games then you are not getting any reward just like we have the arcade milestone okay which we have in the next section, just like we have Arcade Milestone, where we complete any games, Arcade games and Trivia games, and we get some bonus points. Similarly, you have to just make sure your students are active. Try to enroll the students who are really active and do not just try for 100. Try for reaching at least minimum, I think, 800 or 1000, even 600 will also just surpass this level. So try for 1000 people. You can easily get if you have a college and you are a college student, even if you are in networking section, like if you are in working professional, you can just share among your community networks and your friends, maybe your family members and relatives, then this number can be easily reached. Now, one more important thing here in the interest form, there was an option. Do we need to have a YouTube channel also? No need to have a YouTube channel for for all the lab solutions, for all the guidelines, you can just share my channel with your participants and they'll be able to complete the lab. And many of you are asking that, is there any issue if I complete the lab using your videos? So no, all the labs, all the tutorials are well explained, detailed, and all are 
fully adhere with the Google Cloud community and guidelines. So this is the main thing you wanted to I wanted to share and here you can see. So here we have milestone just like we have arcade milestone like novice trooper ranger and champion here we have milestone one milestone two milestone three and ultimate milestone. So here if you complete the milestone one you're getting some all will be getting the certificates for Google. You'll be getting some cool hoodies like earlier we had white hoodie you're getting some cool metal sleeper and a cool Lego diary and here a new swag you can see. The new swag is basically this thing which we'll talk about in the later. I'll show you the new swag. So like this you can see as long as you drive more and more games and trivia games the prizes are increasing over here. So here is the prizes and here is the milestone. You need to drive these many games even if you see if I give a rough example. Yeah, like you drive 799 games 600 trivias and 2800 skill badges then also you are in the milestone one so make sure to gather uh, genuine participants over here and one thing you can do what you can do is you can start just interacting with your students and gather you can create a community or you can just uh, share with the students that a new program will be coming first you need to check that whether you are selected or not then only start this and even if you are not selected do not worry I'll share my facilitators code you can join under us and complete the program as a participants if you are beginner if you are participating for the first time I'll recommend participate as a participant then in the next cohort in cohort 2 which will be from July and December you can just become a facilitator in that cohort so this is the thing you understood the milestone here we have the milestone like if you complete 1200 games 800 trivia games and 5200 skill badges you don't have to complete your participants the students who are enrolled under you will be completing they won't be completing 1200 games or 800 trivias all the students will be completing individually their games and achieving the milestone the number of students like if you have 500 students they are completing some are completing 500 games or 200 if they complete all the four games there will be 2000 games similarly if they complete all the four trivias it will be for uh, 2000 trivias and similarly if they complete the skill badges okay 52 skill badges 100 participants then it will be 5200 skill badges if i make any calculation mistake do not worry we all are humans we make make mistakes so here you can see all these things like premium hard backpack all these things are here we'll just discover about it in the upcoming part of the video so let's come over here to the next thing that is student milestone it you already know this if you have achieved the bonus points like you have completed all these things like six arcade games five trivia games 14 trivia skill badges and six lab free courses lab free courses are nothing just you complete the quizzes and you get bonus points these are eligible these are required for the bonus points in the arcade facilitator program if you complete in normal arcade game you won't be getting any bonus point so this user prizes and milestone is different you have to focus on facilitator milestone and prizes if you are becoming a facilitator if you are becoming a student then you have to focus on this and this is the old data for 2026 new data will be launched like new milestone will be launched new tires will be launched and this you can see the 5200 what is the ultimate milestone will surely go high I think so it will surely go high so just be prepared and uh, just start your journey now here if I show you the swags which is the most anticipating thing you are waiting for so you can see these are the swags like in the cohort one we received a power bank gimbal bottle this bulb if you have achieved in the legend tire also the Lego diary now here in the cohort one of different cohort I think 2023 or 2022 we had received this a cool Amazon uh, sorry Google it's not Amazon Google display a uh, zipper uh, charging kit bag and great black hoodie similarly here in the this cohort we are having this cool bag stylish bottle and this Lego diary and an important cheese is that 
important thing is that that hoodie also that is blue in color so these are the cool swags you can clearly see and now this is how we completed it now do subscribe the channel hype the video and follow us on social media for doubts you can comment down below all your doubts do not worry all the things will be available on the channel if you have any query you can let me know in the comment section guys thank you guys have a great day ahead do like the video do hype the video and if you have any queries you can just comment down so thank you guys have a great day ahead